probably like the last ultrasound, at least the last one that I can record because when I actually go to my doctors, um, I'm not allowed to really record anything. Plus, this is also the last one to where my mom and mother-in-law are able to attend um, with Austin and I. So I figured I could try to get as much footage and all that stuff as possible and record it so that way I could upload it for y'all, that way y'all can see the progress. Um, as of today, I am 32 weeks and four days. So I'm getting close and closer to baby being here. Look at the nose. Oh, it's so easy to see him now. Good now. Oh, yeah. It's like 130 now. Sixty pounds. Okay. Hard pressed to see this little guy. Oh, of course. He's not. Try. He's not cooperative. Try rolling up that way for me. Sir. And because of the placenta, the cord is like all in its base. So I'm gonna have to roll you around and That's push fun. you and try to get the best angle. Look at that, there's his little nose. Hey, stick your tongue out, okay?
He is putting it right up there against the end. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Look at his pig nose. Are you serious? Oh, right of it. Look at it. It's She listened to his umbilical cord and uh -huh. like the flow of it sounded mm -hmm. perfect. No back flow or anything like that. Mm -hmm. Well, then you're perfect. He's just going to be tiny. Yeah. And she said oh, that's possible. And they said they'd keep checking and make sure. Sure. Yeah. Which I go this coming Monday. He is still bound in the shower uh -huh. to keep oh, his yeah. face uh -huh. planted. I would like to say. He doesn't look little. I mean, his face is really full. He doesn't look like. What I normally see with little tiny babies like that. So that that tells me he's mature. Right. Like it, he's just small in weight size, but he's mature. Right. Uh, that's cute. He's my Andrew. No, I'm just kidding. Ooh. All tired, isn't he? <laughs> yes. He's a beauty. Have you been telling everybody bye? Hello, everyone. So it has been. Mm, not too long honestly probably about a week since this has been filmed and I'm going through and trying to finishing all my editing and all that jazz to some videos and trying to catch up and upload them so that way they could go it and get uploaded um but basically during this ultrasound visit we realized that his stomach is still very small it was measuring about like 28 weeks and in this video i was about 32 weeks and two or four days i believe or something like that um i think she measured like part of his leg and his head and one of them were measuring like 29 weeks and the other was still 28 weeks so he was pretty behind and we had went for the anatomy scan back in march uh, i believe it was march 11th and he only weighed two pounds and a few ounces. Well, during this visit, a month later, April 12th, he only weighed two pounds and 14 ounces. So that was very concerning to us. Um, so we are for sure going to be talking to our doctor about it and seeing if there's a reason for it or, you know, if we need to take precautions, if, you know, just, basically anything um we're very stressed about it we're trying not to be stressed because obviously what i feel baby feels but we're very very concerned because and obviously i have a tiny belly hazel may i swear but I sort of kind of have a tiny baby compared to a lot of people. But I've gained about like 21 pounds since being pregnant. It's not like I'm not gaining any weight or anything like that. But there's just a lot of factors that could be going on with baby. And we could just have a tiny baby. But we also just don't know because during the anatomy scan, she mentioned that sometimes, you know, they got to come out sooner than expected due to, you know, not getting the nutrition stuff that they typically need from the placenta and through the umbilical cord and all that stuff. So we're just pretty concerned basically, but I'm going to my doctors um, and hopefully I will be able to like figure some stuff out and update you guys and let you know what, what the verdict is and how everything's going. I swear this dog is preparing me to having a toddler because she is currently in her panting too. So she's mad because I'm not giving her attention. I just kind of wanted to update you all and let you all know what was going on. So, Miss Needy. Anyways, thanks for watching. Um, thank you for being along for this journey. If you're going through something similar, let me know in the comments down below because I'm hoping I'm not the only one and I know every pregnancy is different for every woman. Um, so, and it may not be anything. It could just 
you know, just be a, just nothing and he could just be a tiny baby, but we'll find out. <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. Thank mm -hmm. you.